Hey guys, Dwight and Nero again, here with another Bakugan review. Just going through a few, just a few Bakugan that I got in it when I went to the, to Walmart and got a few packs. This is one of the ones that I like the most, because it's got vacuum metalized plastic, feet and tail. It is, try and get you... Be able to see that that is a chaos attributed. Though so in the show, this is a aquas attributed. There you go. Do, do, do. Open up his little feet. Now he has a cool little feature on his back here, right there. That little triangle. That's a button. And when you push the button, wait. I said when you push the button, little things on the side pop out. Now in the show, there are little faces, like replicas of his head, and they like spit poison and stuff. Anyway, cute little guy, cool little feature that he's got. Um, I believe his name was Phosphos. I'm guessing a play on phosphorus or something. Anyway, next one is Aquas attributed, and this one is, is an oddity among. So I got a little thing on it. But anyway, this one's an oddity among the new generation Bakugan because when he's rolled when he's rolled out, he does not have battle gear. You, you can't equip him with battle gear, but. He still looks very cool. Got a little hands that you pop out right there. So. And then you go down to his feet. A little hard to get these things out. No real place that you can hold, grab onto them. But here's the feature on this guy that I like. Well, like Phosphos, he has a little button. When you pop that button, trying to get so it's like a tongue or I'm not exactly sure what it is, but a little thing that pops out. Looks really cool. This one is um snap snapzoid or something like that. Really cool. Really just a neat little thing. Next one is something I've been looking for for a while. Well, not looking for, but I was hoping that I could get one. It's up Tierra. And it is a... Put the cards. Colorism. Um, I forget what the... Subterra attribute brawler is this season on Gundalian Invaders, but this is his partner, Bakugan. Probably did that out of camera, but good little feet. Nice little detail right here. You can actually see he has fists. But now the part that I, that I found hardest to to do with him was find his G power, which was kind of a little hidden. It's right there underneath his chin, which I know you guys can't see. Uh, actually, I can... And... Oh, camera. Camera. Be good. Be good. Okay. Anyway, zoom that back out. You know, that was... This is Subterra Cordum. He has 780G. It's, oh, I forgot to mention these guys. This one is um, Snapzoid, who is also 780. And Phosphos is 760. Not my most powerful, but... Uh, all my Bakugan are basically around the same G-Power. Um, this one is one I've already done before, but with Chaos. It is an Aquas Lumigrail. With 700 G's. 
weaker than the other one that I have, but I thought I'd, well, I don't have anything else to do right now. Show them off. Um, the reason I'm doing this video right now is because my internet has gone out, which, why well, I have why well, I haven't been uploading anything you further away. Anyway, this one is, I don't know what this one is, because like I said, my internet's out, and I can't look up any, look, look anything up right now. Yeah, I'm a little tongue-tied. Let me pop this guy out. And, yeah, little feetsies. Yeah, really tough little feets to pop out. It's got wings. Now, when I put this video up, I'm probably going to put it what he is in the description, but he has connection points. Doesn't have any um, Battle Gear connection points, but he has connection points that are for Maxis. Cre Maxis, yeah, Maxis Bakugan. Which. I don't know. I know there aren't any Maxis Bakugan and Gundalian Invaders, and the only other Maxis Bakugan that I could think of would be... Because I know this isn't a piece of Maxis Dragonoid, which means that this would have to be a part of Maxis Helios, which it could possibly be. I'm not sure, but... Yeah. Cute little thing. Uh, his G's are right there, and uh, his bias section. 780. Popular number I've noticed among a lot of the Bakugan that I get. But yeah, I suspect that this is the Fox Bat of uh, Maxis Helios, but I'm not 100% certain on that. I'll have to look that up. But put them all right next to each other, the new, new ones. Trying to keep them on. And what the hell? Put the other ones out too. I always mess up with these ones. Anyway. So put this one right here. This is just to show what regular Bakugan I have. No. Just other than my um, Maxis Dragonoid and Dragonoid Colossus, see, this is everything that I have for Bakugan right now. And as you guys can see over here, I have other things that I'm working on reviewing. But for now, this has been Twilight Nero, and I hope you guys stay tuned in for these little mini-sodes, or whatever they're going to be. But, um, when I get more, I'll do more videos, because I usually get these things in um, groups of, like, four-ish, maybe five. But, yeah, until next time. See ya.